I'd like to raise as someone who's outside the Buddhist community, when I was uh, reading a little background about Shakubuku and Shoju, it seemed to be that they were uh, concepts associated with um, promoting a system of belief. Mm -hmm. And that seems different from what in Old Testament terms is the role that the prophets played of, 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 of chastising government that may, and I, I just hate to make this distinction, but on the one hand there's social justice, on the other hand there's ethical, uh, uh, personal practice. Mm -hmm. And which is it for those notions? It's both, all right? Because in my perspective, there's no distinction. In my, that's a false distinction, it's a false dichotomy. Because, at least from our practice, Buddhism, Buddhism is, is everyday life. It's, it's from everything from how you wash your dishes to how you interact with your dog, to how, to, how you interact with your spouse, to how, to how you interact with your boss. It's in everything. So I think, at least from my perspective, that, that's, a, that's a false distinction. Okay. Well, let's go ahead. Well, can you just clarify your question? I'm having I'm a little trouble oh, oh. understanding. I'm um, sorry. Well, I can think about matters of social justice without having to think about enlightenment. Ah, okay, I see, I see, you, you, okay. You can, like there's a, this is kind of a question that people have been struggling with for thousands of years. I started reading some Confucian writings recently, and there's one that's called The Great Learning. And I can't recite it from memory, but the first paragraph is very useful because it talks about how a king seeks to establish order in his kingdom. And it goes through all of these different stages. It's really just a paragraph or two. But at the very end, it says, and so it becomes clear that cultivation of the individual is at the root of harmony in the kingdom. So all of our social interactions and our social institutions and our forms of government ultimately are a reflection of the lives of the individual beings that dwell in that place. So it's through our, there, there isn't, what Ron just said, there really isn't a separation. So what, are, you, are, you, are you wondering like about if, like there's a distinction between like social justice, like, like, like being socially just, like, like it's um, somebody doesn't need to like, this is like something that's like, essential, like on the, on somebody can only be like spiritually enlightened to be socially just, is that what you're wondering? Or? That's, that's one of the things I'm wondering. Yeah, so I think that's, that's a good question. And I think in terms of Buddhism, um,